Hi everyone, welcome to day 14 of my lifestyle change, and there's my cat over here. That was Cashew. Um, I um, got him as a rescue pet from Petcetera and Prince George, along with his brother Johnny. Um, their name was Johnny Cash, Johnny and Cash, but I changed Cash to Cashew because he's my little peanut. But anyways, um, day 14 is good. I didn't make a video yesterday because... Um, on Monday night, my mom wasn't feeling very well, and turns out she was suffering really bad allergy. So we had to go to the hospital at like 11:30 that night. I'm usually in bed trying to fall asleep by that time, but um, I didn't get in till about one o'clock, and then of course I was fully awake then, and um, I didn't fall asleep till about two. And so the next day I was running an hour and a half behind and I still had to work um, later that day for eight hours. So I didn't have the time to, um, stupid hair is like bugging me. Here we go. Oh, well, whatever. Um, yeah, so I didn't have the time to make the video yesterday. I barely had time to do my cardio. I almost debated on not doing my cardio, but I figured um, I can't let anything in life when it doesn't go the way I want to I can't let it stop me from reaching my goals so um I did the cardio <sighs> sorry it's raining really bad here and I went outside and ever since I went outside my hair has been frizzier and uh, more of a jerk so yeah I hate it anyways um yesterday I only did nine laps because I was running behind but today I broke my new record so I heard someone use the term um, non-scale victory is for when you accomplish something that has nothing to do with the scale numbers. For my, so for my non-scale victory today, um, I broke my record of laps and that was 14 um, laps around the diamond running. Not all at once, but in my intervals. I'm slowly leading up to one day I'm hoping to just do running laps for an hour straight. That would be another uh, non-scale victory. But that's a long-term goal right now but uh, yeah things are going good uh, I adjusted my calorie intake because I had on my fitness pal it was set to um, sedentary so basically a lifestyle where you're sitting at the computer all day um, not exercising and just using diet alone to lose weight um, I'm exercising for an hour at least an hour five more like six times a week now Friday is my rest day so I had to adjust it because sometimes at night I was so so hungry and drained and you know I just felt like I wasn't getting enough so I got 200 extra calories a day now and I noticed yesterday I was still a bit hungry but not like how I was the days before so they say you should go to bed hungry but uh yeah but it's all working out now um, it's like a learning game when you're learning to lose weight um, everything is trial and error so I've learned a few things um, adjusted a few things uh, yeah not much else to talk about today I did the mini challenge which was a hundred overhead tricep extensions but if you did them last week you had to add at least 10 so I did because I did it last week so I did 110 overhead tricep extensions I bought my push-ups and my um, crunches to uh, more numbers per set. So slowly getting up there. It's day 14. They say it takes 21 days to get in the new habit. So I got seven more days to go. And then I'm confident that um, things won't be as bad. But it's not even bad, you know. I know that's the saying, but um, I, I feel good. I don't. I'm surrounded by temptation all the time at work and my sister she's pregnant so she gets these weird cravings all the time and she brings them into the house but I haven't faltered yet and I'm alone right now like and there's mini donuts here or um, pecan tarts there or she has strawberry shortcake you know and I could easily just be eating it but um, and no one would know but it's a lie to myself and um, I want to give myself a more honorable treatment than that because I think I deserve better than that um, yeah so not much else going on 
uh, day off and in the next two days I work. So I'll try my best to get a video out there. Thank you for all my viewers, all like two of you. It's awesome. I appreciate the support. Uh, yeah, so I hope everyone else is having some non-scale victories today or just having an awesome day. Enjoying, if you live anywhere near I do in Williams Lake, uh, Canada, I hope you enjoyed the awesome little storm we had. My whole driveway flooded. I got pictures on Facebook of that. Anyways, uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow, and you all have an awesome day. Bye.